The sequel to 300 includes just about everything you'd expect. Digital blood splatter, hulking shirtless dudes with swords, and beautifully rendered digital landscapes. I didn't expect all of that to get upstaged by the diabolical Eva Green, who plays a vengeful Persian commander. She wants revenge on the Greeks, who slaughtered her family and sold her into slavery. As the force behind Xerxes the God King from the first film, For glory's sake! For vengeance sake! Whoa! She slices and dices her forces through the Greek navy on a path to conquer Athens. Do you gentlemen find my command unreasonable? Is it too much to ask for victory? Following 300, Rise of an Empire is more of the same, utilizing a similar storytelling style while trying to expand the overall scope and the body count. Very few of the characters have anything memorable to do other than swing their swords and yell, Save your glory! But Eva Green, she relishes her role with such wicked delight, she easily outshines all of her fellow actors and the stylish special effects. If you like your Greek history told through the lens of a professional wrestler, 300 Rise of an Empire makes a fine compliment to its predecessor. I'm John, at the Movies.